Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius Fire Sign. Today I am going to do a complete love reading and this is general may or may not resonate to everyone. And take what resonates and leave the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys. Then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. So if you want a personal reading, comment me in comment box and it is chargeable. And if you want to win a free reading, do like and comment on my videos. I will announce winner on every month, 30 and 31st. So let's see. Your message is Sagittarius, Fire Sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And if you want to manifest your SP or if you want to manifest communication from your SP, I can guide you. So if you any, if anybody want coaching, comment me in comment box. So let's see your messages. Sagittarius, Fire Sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. First we will see the present energy in your relationship. Justice and hanged man under the deck and ten of wands. Very, very heavy energy. So right now, there is no balance for sure in this relationship. That's why this connection is stuck and you both are feeling overburdened here. So definitely no stability, no clarity. And you both are right now unable to balance things in this connection. Lots of you, you both are not talking because this connection is stuck. If you both are talking, that communication could be also on and off. So justice means you both want to balance things in this connection here because right now, no balance. So you both are thinking about balance. So let's say your person current feelings towards you. Knight of Cups with uh, Eight of Wands and the Moon. Some of you are dealing with Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Uh, especially Pisces water sign. So Sagittarius, you person have very, very deep emotions for you because Knight of Cups. Definitely they have very, very deep emotions. But right now they are not uh, expressing, but they want to. Definitely in near future, they will express their feelings here uh, through communication because Eight of Wands, your person is thinking about communication, Eight of Wands. So I'm seeing... You both will communicate back and forthly very, very soon. And your person is right now uh, listening to their intuition and trusting their inner voice because the moon card is here. And dearth and rebirth and five of swords. I'm saying it is a uh, major transformation for your person because dearth and rebirth, five of swords and the moon. Definitely major transformation. Uh, your person right now going through a major transformation. And yes, some of you are dealing with Scorpio water sign. Now they are realizing uh, you both uh, recently both had some issue with each other. But now they're getting clarity that you are right. Maybe they were wrong. So they are getting that clarity. Uh, so they're listening to their intuition and trusting their inner voice. And finally, they want to communicate with you. For some, maybe they want to say sorry to you. Because Knight of Cups, it's all about communication also. So they want to express their love or they want to say sorry also. So let's see your current feelings towards your person. King of Wands is the tower and death. Oh my God. 
Sagittarius, some of you are also going through some transformation here. Because right now there is no balance in this connection. So you disturbed a lot because the tower with the uh, dearth and rebirth and four of pentacles. But you are not expressing your feelings here. Because four of pentacles means emotionally holding back and dearth card. Definitely you both are going through a transformation. It's mutual. And the tower... You both are suffering a lot. Yes, I'm seeing you both are suffering a lot. You're also very attracted to this person because King of Wands. Sagittarius. But you don't want to express your feelings. So let's see your person next move. What is the next move? Seven of Cups with Three of Wands. I want to clarify Seven of Cups. Nine of Pentacles. Three of Cups. Okay. So you person need to make a decision here. For some maybe third party involved here. Uh, three of Wands with Three of Cups for sure. So you person is in some confusion right now. Or for some they have options also. So they are thinking right now. But I am not seeing any immediate action from the end. But they are expecting progress in this connection. Because three of wands is here. They want progress. Uh, but they are thinking about stability. But I am not seeing immediate action from the end. First they need to uh, get clarity regarding this relationship. So do you want to take any action from your end Sagittarius? Do you want to take any action from your end? Two of Wands with the Eight of Pentacles. You really want to invest on this connection. Uh, but you are also thinking. Two of Wands. You are also deeply thinking about your person. You are thinking about pros and cons. Some of you are dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Fire Sign. But you are very serious about this person. Definitely you are very, very serious. So let's see what is the outcome of this relationship and where this relationship is headed up. So you both definitely missing a lot and you both are suffering in silence here. I'm seeing you both are suffering in silence, but I'm seeing communication. Your person is going to communicate with you, Sagittarius. Maybe right now they are not taking immediate action, but I'm seeing communication. Yeah, they will communicate with you, but regarding stability or regarding commitment, maybe they will not say anything right now, but they need some time. But a communication, I'm seeing definitely you will get communication. Ten of Swords. So they want a rebirth in this relationship because you, they want to end this cycle. You both are suffering in silence. So let's see what is the advice for you regarding the situation or relation. Seven of Swords with Four of Cups and the Moon. Oh my God. So Sagittarius, right now you're feeling uh, unhappy and you're feeling uh, confused also because the Moon is here. So first you need to get clarity and you have some trust issues also because seven of swords. You are trying to hide your feelings. Seven of swords with four of cups. Definitely you are trying to hide your feelings. Don't hide your feelings. Express your feelings with your person because they are going to communicate with you. You need to express. Then only your person knows what you are going through. So let's see some messages from your person and through the channel. I feel so alone. Yes, they feel so alone. I want to be honest with you. You are the only one for me. So let's see romantic love messages. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. And both waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life. 
so this is the reading for you guys hope it resonate to you please do share like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon then you will get all my video notifications thank you so much for watching and supporting me please do like the video guys thank you